fill a beaker with water, boil the water. Once the water has boiled, place a leaf into the boiling water for 2 minutes. After 2 minutes, turn, on the, turn off the Bunsen flame. Remove the leaf from the boiling water and transfer it into a boiling tube. Add sufficient alcohol to the boiling tube containing the boiled leaf. When carrying out this step, ensure that there's no naked flame near the bottle of alcohol. Alright, the reason is because alcohol is flammable. Transfer the boiling tube containing the boiled leaf into the beaker of warm water. Leave it there for 10 minutes. Okay, the purpose of this step is to for the alcohol to decolorize the leaf. Okay, basically what alcohol does is it removes the chlorophyll and makes the leaf colorless. Okay, and this will actually make it easier for us to observe the result of the iodine test which we will carry out in a while. After incubating the leaf in warm alcohol for 10 minutes, discard the alcohol into an empty beaker. Add in water to rinse the leaf to remove the traces of alcohol. Okay, now using a glass straw, gently uh, stir the leaf to the upper surface of the boiling tube. And then use a forceps to extract the leaf. Okay, if you look at the leaf now, it's slightly uh, lighter green in colour. Okay, but if you are using a very highly concentrated alcohol, alright, the leaf will be completely white. But in this case, we are only using around 70% alcohol, alright, 70 to 95% alcohol, alright, the removal of the chlorophyll will not be complete. Okay, this is what you need to do now. Cover the leaf with iodine. And report your observation. Okay? Now, if you recall, if starch is present in a green leaf, all right, the leaf will turn blue-black in the presence of iodine. Okay, it's slowly turning blue-black. All right, it's slowly turning blue-black. I leave it to you to have fun with the experiment. All right, to discover the actual coloration. All right.